Hello everyone, this is Imran Nuhu. In this video training, I am going to create a logo slider using a WordPress logo slider plugin named TC logo slider. So here it is, TC logo slider. Here I am in the dashboard of my WordPress website and from the plugins menu, I am going to navigate to the add new menu. Here I would like to search for TC logo slider plugin to install it. So search for TC logo slider here it is this is tc logo slider plugin and it's developed by themes code now i would like to hit this install now button and install it the plugin has been installed now i would like to activate this plugin just going to click on this button you will come to know about the features available in the pro version the plugin home link support link demo link etc i'm going to check all the menus on the left all logos i have already added several logos so you can see a list of logos here and add new logo from this menu you will just create new logos and categories if you have several categories of logos just you can create categories here say for example i have created clients category partners category just like this and logo setting we have provided a minimal version of setting panel for the free version and in the premium version we will get extended setting panel of i'll come to this point after a while so from this here all logos i'm going to edit a logo just to show you how i added this here is the title of the logo or the brand name and I added feature image as logo and client. will see uh, the carousel will show only the logos from partners category it's great if you would like to change the order ascending or descending you can just use this attribute also it changes now it's time to customize it through the setting panel I'm going to click on logo settings first of all from the basic setting you can turn on or off the autoplay feature autoplay timeout stop on hover suppose if I hover over this logo it will stop moving and if you don't want this just change from here set to no carousel low 
it will loop the carousel continuously you can put it yes or no and the vital thing is changing the number of logos on desktop large desktop in tabloid and in mobile phone screen now it shows five logos you can change it to six save changes and refresh here it shows six logos you can down it to four at the same way you can change these values also for tablets and mobile phone so let's see what's in the advanced setting show navigation if you don't like to show this navigation just you can turn it down here it's gone at the same time you can also hide these small dots the last thing is group logo images if you have logo images with different sizes then you can let this plugin to crop your images automatically and you will have to mention the expected logo width and height i'm going to select no and the plugin won't resize your logo the logos will be natural in size just refresh here it is before i finish i would like to show the navigation and dots again and set crop logo image to yes and save changes this will come back again that's great thank you very much thank you for watching if you like this video please subscribe my youtube channel and you can also check the pro features of this plugin and go to the plugin demo through this link you will see all the demos of the pro version just go through these links and check out and i regularly update these plugins so you won't have to worry about the updatation thank you very much thank you for watching